story time. Hello everyone, I'm George Buxton. Guess what? It's time for a story. Today, I'm going to read you the story of I Love You Already by Jory John and Benji Daves. Now, when you hear this song, Ah, I love you, but... Oi, cut that out! That means that there will be a duck and bear in a book again. Oh, at this time, it's all about Doug who just wants the bear to love him back. But will bear love him back? Find out as I will read you a story. So, are you ready? Here we go. I love you already. Oh, good morning everybody. I'm Duck and I bring you a book called 101 Talks to Take with Bears. Oh well, let's see how we're doing on Bear. Over to Bear now. Oh, I really love spending lazy weekend mornings around my house. A boarding stroll would be nice. Hmm, I wonder what our bear is up to. Ah, oh, perfect. I have everything. I need to spend a pleasant day by myself. Hey, bear! It's dark. Come next door. Open up. Come on, buddy. Oh, what is that dark? I'm busy. You don't look busy. Besides, we're going for a walk, friend. No arguments. Chop, chop. Spencer, what have you done together? No, I'll tell you my life story. No, you'll tell me your life story? No, we'll get some exercise. No, we'll look at the clouds. No, uh, I'll tell you my life story. <gasps> you already said that. But maybe you would like me more. I like you already, Doc. Well, I'm not taking no for an answer there. We're having fun, whether you want to or not. Ugh. Hey, take a, take a look around, Bear. Who wants to be alone on a day like this? Me. Nonsense. Would you like a nice pop, Bear? Oh, I suppose, uh, Bear, I might need to borrow a little money. Ugh. Isn't this nice? No. Pleasant? No. Lovely? No. Uh, wonderful? No. The absolute best morning you've ever had? No. Uh, pleasant? Oh, you already said that. I just want you to like me, Bear. I like you already. But also, I'd like, I also like quiet time by myself. If you need me, I'll be relaxing by my train. Oh, I'm bored already. Now this is puzzle. Yes. Psst. Bear. Oh. Oh. Ah. Oh. Oh. Ow. Doc. Doc. Are you okay? Oh, why do you care? What do you mean? My best friend, Doc. You sure don't act like it. You like my brother. <laughs> yeah, right. I should have caught you. I am great. Oh. You don't even like me, do you, Ben? Nonsense. You're basically my family. I love you already, Doc. Really? You mean it, Ben? Do you? You do? Huh? <sighs> yes. Ah, that's... Such good news, Bear. Now we can go on money walks together. Every single day. How fun. How perfect. Especially because we live right next door to each other. I always know where to find you. Oh, right. So, you want to see me run really fast, Bear? No. Juggle five apples? No. Swim across this lake? No. Eat a bug? No. I hold my breath. <gasps> no. Uh, run really fast. Oh, you already said that. Ah, well, see you tomorrow, Bear. Bright and early. And I love you. I love you already too, old chum. Oh, I've got to stop answering my door. Ah. <laughs>
and we hope you enjoyed the story of I Love You Already. Well, it looks like Bear has to learn a lesson because he loves Duck already. But Bear, however, never gets to relax by himself now, because it looks like he's going to have to go to some morning walks every morning. All right, you kids. Now, if you're going to school tomorrow, uh, just make sure, just don't go out by yourself. Just ask your parents if you want to go for a morning walk. All right, so that's the end of the story now. So I'm going to say goodbye now, viewers, and I shall see you again soon. And until then, bye-bye, everyone. Bye-bye.